Hello, Potter. Draco. Draco, was it you who sent me the anonymous owl asking me to meet them outside the Room of Requirement? Yes, it was me. Now, Potter, I know that over the years I've been rather nasty and mean and I've bullied you a little bit and I've been overall very unpleasant. Yes, Draco, you have. And if you don't mind, get to the point. You're wasting my time. I have very important Harry Potter things to do. Well, I've brought you here because... There's a reason for all of it. What do you mean? There's a reason for for everything that uh, maybe maybe I should just show you. You see, my tastes are very singular. Draco, I'm confused. Just come in. The room of requirement should should have everything I require. Draco, what is all this? This is... this is just kind of who I am. What? I mean, this is... that's a sex swing, I'm pretty sure. Draco, is that a sex swing? That is indeed a sex swing. And I've brought you here because... I've wondered if... if maybe we could use it together. Draco, what? This is all so sudden, I don't understand. You've been so mean and nasty. I've been nasty because I don't know how to explain these feelings I've had for you for so long. Draco, I... I'm sorry, Draco, I just need to... Harry, wait! What's this? Oh, I think I can go inside. What bizarre world is this? It's everything is... Is in squares. It's all boxes, it looks like. Good heavens, what is that? You better not keep coming near me, not one step closer. You don't want me to, to use my magic wand. All right, you've asked for it. Wingardium Leviosa. I need to get out of here. It just keeps going on and on and on and I fear that I am lost. What in the bloody hell is that? Oh, good lord. I fear the only thing that will take him down is the killing curse. But of course the killing curse is forbidden. And I, the chosen one, Harry Potter, couldn't possibly use the killing curse. Don't worry, Harry. I'm not the chosen one and people don't like me much anyway. Heck, people expect me to use the killing curse. Let me take care of it. Avada Kedavra! Oh, thank you so much, Draco. You saved my life. Oh, don't mention it, Harry. And I just want to apologize for earlier. It was all very sudden, I understand. And I mean, if you don't feel the same, I... But Draco... Yes, Harry? I do feel the same. I've loved you for so long. It's just that when you took me into that room and I saw the whips and the chains and I was basically a torture dungeon. It was very frightening, Draco. I got very scared and I ran, but... But I do love you, Draco. I always have. Oh, Harry, kiss me. <sighs> now come on, let's go back to Hogwarts. I know the way, follow me. Oh, Draco. And let's head back to the Room of Requirement. I have a few more ideas of how we can use it, because I require some time alone with you. Oh, Harry! <laughs> well, wasn't that dumb? If you're really confused as to what just happened, um, it was a tradition on my channel that every Thanksgiving I would do a turkey, a turkey puppet retelling of the Hunger Games movies, and I started it as of Catching Fire, so I've done Catching Fire and Mockingjay Part 1 and 2, and the links are somewhere around here. I don't know how I'm doing it yet. So let me know down in the comments what you thought of it, and also let me know in the comments if you want to see any other slash fiction, because I'm just a slashaholic. I'm just slashing, slashing, slashing all that fan fiction. Also make sure to like this video and click subscribe, because the videos only get weirder from here. Thanks so much for watching, and if you live in America, have a happy Thanksgiving. Bye!